important and we're so blessed to have them with us here tonight so this is really like our triple crown so here we go Jean you're up first And we just want to thank all of the directors who were so generous in all of their gift giving so we can make this night even more. Thank you to everybody. Okay. I want to do a big shout out. I want to do a quick video and then we're going to do a little dance. Just really quick. That I want to send to Doris and to Tracy. Just to, you know, show the excitement that is happening out here in Long Island. So, Long Island. Yeah, all they're going to do is like a big woohoo! Okay, and I'm going to start over here. Like, like the way. Okay? Like the way. And a one and a two. I'm and impressed a three. that she knows how to do that. with us tonight so okay here we go all of our consult just consult consultant level and senior consultant could you please stand I want to kind of see who's here I go to you all right team leaders please stand who's a team leader come on all right I love it you're on the way to director room Okay, directors, please stand. Any of our directors? And of course, those new directors are so excited because we have national conference right around the corner in the Chicagoland area where you are going to be walking the stage. Are you guys excited, new directors? Yes, good. All right, advanced directors. Do we have advanced directors in the house? What? <laughs> I love it. Okay, I know that we have an executive, executive director. Oh, Paula Brockner. So I have to tell you, Carrie and I, Carrie Ann and I got to the hotel kind of late because you guys have like a lot of traffic out here. <laughs> And there is sitting Paula Brackner from Wisconsin. I was like, what are you doing here, Paula? And she was like, just having fun. <laughs> just having fun with the girls. I love it. Okay, senior executive directors. Senior direct, senior exec, well, you're closing in. You just, soon, soon you will be a senior executive director, Sharon Zellin. You're tracking, you're tracking. And of course, Jill Lerna, our National Executive Director. Please stand. All right, who, anybody come as a guest with your consultant or your spouse, any guests, please stand. Please stand, come on guests. I love it. Are some of you looking at the opportunity? Oh, yeah. Okay, well, Pamper Chef is where it's at. So we're gonna have a fun night, of course, but I'm gonna share some things that we typically share at an opportunity event. And an opportunity event is um, a meeting that, of course, we love to talk about Pamper Chef and all the great things that we have to offer, mixed in with uh, just a couple little updates that I wanna provide to our existing consultants. And I know I brought, or I sent, actually, three 
every day, I think they're the everyday rock crock that I think I sent. Uh, I sent to Sharon and Jill three everyday rock crocks and we are going to raffle those off for anybody that is going to sign their agreement tonight and start a pamper chef business. So keep that in mind. Okay, so I need the little right clicker. So this is the other ones. There's three of them. them. They advance them for us. Okay, let's see if this works. Oh. oh, it did. Okay, we're starting with a fun little video. Dance it, your seat should be buttoned. <laughs> Look at that catalog from 1983. Woo! Woo! First National Conference. repurposing it because it's just a lot of fun isn't it isn't it great to just take a walk down uh, memory lane so many fun memories but uh, the new milestone of course that we introduced the last national conference was our new logo with a happy spoon in it and we are loving this new logo aren't we it's just so fun I'm seeing people with the new logo on outfits, a little shirts or backpacks, your phone cases. It's just so wonderful. And I think, I think our customers and hosts are really loving it too. So it's fun. A lot of things we can do with it. Whoops. So today, Pamper Chef, of course, we are a premier direct seller, right? Of high quality kitchen products that we're all very proud of out loud. We are in the top 20 of direct selling companies in the direct selling industry, and we are committed to helping families gather around the table for dinner each and every night. Each one of you contributes to that, and I wanna thank you for your dedication towards our mission of really helping to bring families around the table. That's what we're all about. It is so incredibly powerful and so relevant and more important today than ever before, in my opinion. What do you guys think about that, right? It's like so important. Yes, give yourselves a round of applause. You guys do amazing things. Okay, am I skipping? I think I'm skipping things. I feel like we missed something back here. We did miss something. Wahoo! Am I going the wrong way? Hold it. Am I going the wrong way? No, you were going the right way. Am I? Okay, I feel like I'm, hold on one second, guys. Okay. There we go. Three star. Oh my gosh, stand up. Stand up. Look at who's on this. I love it. So look at this. Direct 
selling industry, it's such a powerful and it's a growing industry and something that certainly we are all very proud to be a part of. Look at these stats. 74% of American adults have purchased through direct selling because, you know, how many of you have gone into a retail store lately? I have to tell you, it is hard to find anybody to provide service or really knowledge about a product. You guys, when you go into somebody's home and do a cooking show, you are providing such an amazing service. You know your product, you give incredible features and benefits of those products. You can't get that anywhere in today's marketplace except for Pamper Chef and of course our great industry. 34.5 billion United States sales in this entire, in this entire industry. It is amazing and it continues to grow. 18 million Americans involved in direct selling, 74% 74% I can't even talk, say that direct selling meets or exceeds their expectations. Uh, and 89% of direct sellers decide to work part-time, offering busy parents and caregivers, you know, everybody. It really, really is such an incredible opportunity for so many individuals. Men, women, I mean, moms, uh, individuals that need to supplement their income, uh, just to be able to go out and have a social life if you have a lot of kids or whatever it might be. I'd love to know, do you mind? I'm gonna like pick on you. You are here to look at the opportunity. What has intrigued you about it? The product, do you love the product? And the way people talk about it. I was at um, Ann Taylor Loft, got shocking on Saturday, <laughs> stop shocking. I was there looking for things for Atlantis, I have to be honest. And so when I was checking out, the woman said, oh my gosh, you're with Pampered Chef. I love Pampered Jones. <laughs> and I gave her my card and she's gonna book a show. That's like, whoa, bada bing, bada boom. Okay, moving on. Okay, I'm, I'm having a... Mm -hmm. It's not advanced. Did it advance? Okay, I already did that one. Okay. So let's talk a little bit about our charitable giving programs. Of course, Help With Cancer. We had our Help With Cancer in the month of May. We're, we're doing it right now. Since 2000, we've contributed close to $12 million, and that continues to grow. And of course, Feeding America, which is helping so many families to be able to provide food on the table. It's amazing. We are very blessed as individuals that are in this room. And sometimes we just don't realize how many families really need contribution to Feeding America to, again, put food on their table. And this is a noble thing that each and every one of you contributes to every time you do a cooking show. And I want to thank you on behalf of everybody at The Pampered Chef for all of your contributions for, again, helping to feed hungry families each and every day. Give yourselves a round of applause for that. Thank you. Uh, of course, we have a great partnership with Berkshire Hathaway, uh, Warren Buffett. In fact, the uh, Berkshire Hathaway annual meeting just happened a couple weekends ago. Uh, and, you know, Warren was just so, and still is, so intrigued by Doris Christopher, and who isn't, right? Here is an individual that started with $3,000 and turned it into a thriving business. It's it's just such an amazing story. Sharon, what? Sharon's boyfriend? Oh, Warren. Oh, is this your boyfriend on the side? <laughs> Sharon's, Sharon's dying a slow death up here, like, what is she talking about? Um, at any rate, and of course, our chief executive officer, Tracy Burke Cool, who about the first week when I had a meeting with her, I looked across the table at her and I said, do you realize, Tracy, that I have been in this industry longer than you, than you have been on this planet? <laughs> and I thought to myself, I'm not too sure that that was a good thing to say or a bad thing to say. But at any rate, here is this amazing individual, 32 years of age. about how can we simplify, improve, and reinvent the business to help each and every one of you to have a thriving business with Pampered Chef. And that's what we do each and every day at the home office, is work on behalf of you. 
our team members just love what they do for each and every one of you. We serve you each and every day. Maybe I need to be more patient. Okay. And this is our new officer team. We have a, a lot of new faces. You've probably been hearing a little bit about this. And we're so excited. And of course, we have somebody new down there. But let me get through and then I'm going to bring up one of our newest. Um, so if you look at the back row, 